past 20 years almost so i have taken data from 2006 to 2020 so it's almost uh, 16 years of data uh, this will be a very intensive video because uh, we wanted to analyze what will be the you know average salary after this covid uh, impact on the economy okay so what we did was uh, i went back to 2000 uh, six seven eight nine you, during that time you know there was a huge recession that happened and uh, we have analyzed the data over there completely and i made this uh, very nice uh, uh, excel sheet uh, con consisting of uh, colleges in every band like see the top colleges abc uh, you know excel and you know great lakes imt ximb almost many colleges in almost every band i have tried to cover so that you know you will get a very clear idea of uh, what to expect after say two years of your mba okay so this is a most asked question in our groups also so is mba feasible right now so for that reason i did this analysis okay so let me just share you uh, okay the screen okay so this is a thing that i did so mba salary trends over years and impact during recession so i have taken data from starting 2006 till 2020 this was the data available on the websites okay so I done for ac ik xmb fms ift spj and mdi nitty sgm som it bombay imt gaziabad jbims mumbai xlri great lakes vgsom sibm pune uh, we have taken a few other colleges also so that you'll get some idea okay so this has been taken and uh, so let's see how it is going okay so first thing what we did was uh, so i had taken uh, just two colleges so cozy code and indoor and uh, all the salary data uh, okay so uh, what was the average ctc back in 2006 it was just nine lakh rupees and there was 115 students that's it this was the intake Okay, and come jump to say the during the recession year. Okay, so 2009 uh, during the recession time. Okay, so just before recession, the packages were about 14.83 lakhs. Okay, so during recession, what happened was there was an immediate drop in salary packages. So how much was the drop? It's clearly evident. Okay, it is almost say uh, from 14.83 it has dropped to 10.61 lakhs okay and the student number has not increased a lot so it is clearly evident that the salary decreased a lot so even in indoor it was 12.7 pre-recession and uh, it became 10.29 immediately the next year you know after the recession happened so it is clearly evident that the salaries have dropped almost 25 to 30 percent in colleges okay so this was the salary trend okay see in this graph uh, i want to highlight just this graph right now okay so you can clearly see that uh, the salary kept on increasing uh, there was continuous spikes there was huge uh, spike in especially course code salary and it it became an immediate drop okay uh, this is very much expected because uh, at the times of recessions there will be something called frozen hiring uh, which corporates follow uh, during which time they don't hire any new uh, people in their companies all right so this is how it has gone you know uh, but immediately after that there is some amount of recovery okay uh, so uh, it was 14 before uh, and the next year after that so it came back to say 12 12.1 12 12.2 and again it took basically two years for it to come back to pre-recession levels like resemble okay what happened was during the recession years uh, what i understood was there was very less ppos offered so ppos are something that is offered at the end of first year for students who are doing internships and uh, that generally places around 25 to 35 percent of the batch in some colleges it will be as high as 50 percent of the batch when ppos weren't offered uh, there was a huge competition in the end and because of which you know there was uh, lesser packages offered okay and uh, yeah it it became slightly higher 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 again due to, during 2013 there was a small drop and again see uh, over the years the trend is going very high like it's going amazingly high okay and uh, the, just look at the packages that they have been offered in 2020 2020 was a phenomenal year for every college okay 
uh, indoor made 28.8 and uh, cozy code made 26.5 this this salary is a huge peak okay so 23.4 25 was the 2019 figure okay and this this thing 2020 figure was basically like uh, something that uh, was kind of extrapolated okay so come back uh, so what i have done one more thing is yearly ctc for four colleges has been compared okay so one was calcutta ahmedabad indoor course code okay so ahmedabad topmost college and uh, uh, Calcutta, Indore, Kosikur, all are top colleges. Okay, so how we can compare this? Uh, we are just looking at it from the salary perspective. Okay, so what happened in the years before recession and after recession, just to get that idea, you know, just to get that trend uh, to clearly be observed. So I made this. Okay, so see pre recession year see 2016 2000 uh, 2006 2007 2008 it is continuously increasing and uh, it peaked a lot at 2008 and then uh, 17.85 ahmedabad and uh, calcutta 16.4 cozy code 14.83 and then you know there was a small drop that happened immediately during recession actually it was a huge drop okay so from say 17.85 uh, AS placement came down to 12.17. Okay, so it took another two years for it to come back to similar levels. I wouldn't say same levels, but yeah, it it kind of you know recovered in few colleges. It it surpassed few colleges. It uh, came back to the same level. Okay, so this is the same four colleges, but the, this is the trend till 2019-2020. Uh, okay. So from 2006, there is like uh, continuous data that is being fed and uh, you can see how the salary packages are increasing at such a phenomenal rate over the years. And a few colleges are, you know, leading the charge like Ahmedabad, Calcutta and Kozikodar and Indore are over here. And it's like excellent placements uh, at every college. Okay. So now uh, I want to get you to the master chart. Okay where uh, all the data of all the colleges uh, that we had spoken about okay so uh, all that is compiled in one place so here are the colleges okay so calcutta ahmedabad jbims xlra fms sp jain indoor uh, scm som uh cozy code mdi nitty vjsom ift delhi xmb bhuneshwar great lakes imt all these colleges like in every band is covered okay so you can clearly see what is the placement figures that is going on in these colleges starting from 2006 to 2011 okay so how the placements got affected see okay let's start with say a college like ima okay so since we have already seen that figures also so ima had phenomenal placements uh, in 2008 okay so 2008 the placement figure was 17.85 and immediately when covid has happened uh, sorry when the recession has happened uh, that has impacted the salary figures to 12.17 but you know again they have recovered a bit in the next year and then they have almost recovered completely in two years time okay so this is how it has been uh, for im ahmedabad uh, then let's look at some college um, randomly I'm just choosing here say let's look at MDI Gurga okay MDI Gurga had 12.25 in uh, 2008 and 2009 it's dropped to 10.45 lakhs almost a 20% drop and again there's a incremental 10-15% gain and then again it has completely recovered by 2011 okay say coming uh, to IFT Delhi IFT Delhi had a placement of almost 10 lakh rupees in 2008 and it dropped to around 8 lakh rupees in 2009 and again in 2010 surprisingly it has recovered and it has gone beyond 10.5 lakhs okay and again 2011 it has increased to 11.6 so the trend is not grim for every college there is hope for a few colleges which uh, you can see in this list okay the same is the case with uh, say empty Ghaziabad uh, seems to be not at all affected because of the recession 
So it was 8.67, it came to 8.3 and again 8.46 and 8.63. So not every college will be impacted, but definitely there will be a lot of roles that uh, you know uh, won't be able to access during this uh, cold recession. So it's like uh, you, you need to take a, a very uh, like you know positive out, uh, you know uh, perspective right now because it's clearly evident that within two years everything got recovered so if you are a student who are joining mba right now you must definitely go i agree there is some impact uh, due to online mode of coaching uh, but you know all that will be quelled uh, and uh, you know the uh, the professors are super smart and they will ensure that you will be learning things in a much better way and uh, they'll ensure that there is bonding and they'll ensure that uh, there is teamwork and a um, lot of synchrony happening and uh, all the colleges are heavily investing in uh, you know it infrastructure and uh, they have been doing trial runs they have been doing trials with seniors and uh, they are they are uh, taking care of the situation okay uh, if you have got amazing colleges all these are very good colleges top notch colleges in the list so you can go ahead I mean, obviously, I can tell you one thing that there will be, you know, definitely less a number of pre-placement offers. This is what has been told by many seniors to me as well in these colleges. Uh, but that shouldn't stop you from, you know, getting there and, uh, you know, gaining the knowledge. Because at the end of the day, you are over there to gain knowledge and understand and become a, you know, corporate leader or go do something outside okay so you should definitely you know join this year so don't worry and uh, this is the trends so you can pause the video and watch the trends i'm just uh, stopping at every chart uh, for a few seconds so that you'll get the idea okay and uh, just share it with all the students who are joining college this year or have got you know some uh, some uh, fear inside them that okay uh, should we study for cat this year because covid has happened and uh, will it impact our salaries and all that so don't uh, don't have such fears so go ahead and uh, do well all right uh, so all the best guys um, do uh, subscribe to our channel and share it with all aspirants uh, do let me know in comments uh, if you want any other videos like such kind of comparison there was a lot of hard work that has gone into taking uh, this video project because there was a huge amount of data to be collected. So please share, like, and uh, thank you. Subscribe to Embark. So this was Suhas Jiram uh, signing off now. Okay, thank you guys.